Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Wes, That Tech Guy. Today we're gonna to talk about external storage and cloud services, cloud storage, and specifically we're going to talk about the new WD My Cloud Mirror. Be sure to check the comments down below in the description area where I'll place a link where you can pick this up and I'll put a couple of other links down below uh, for some other things that will go with this system. Be sure to subscribe to my channel so you can catch the latest and greatest tech videos I'm going to be putting out as well as stuff I do in my everyday life. So uh, that Tech Guy channel is a tech channel for the most part. I'll do some vlogging here as well. And if there's anything you'd like to see me do, be sure to list it down below. I'll be sure to respond back to your comments and definitely be sure to check up here and look for some of my other videos. Uh, I got a great list of them. All right, so let's open this uh, WD My Cloud mirror up and see what we've got inside. Got a nice little hello card. Looks like we've got a great little instruction Box of hardware here. Simple three step instructions on how to use this thing. I mean, if you can do these three steps, take it out of the box, plug it in, plug it into your network, and go to the website address. This is a no-brainer for anybody. And this is a cloud storage system where you will back up everything to your network. So you won't plug this into your computer, you'll actually plug this into your router, uh, into your network. And you'll be able to access those files or anything you back up on the My Cloud Mirror from anywhere in the world you're at. There's apps for your iPhone, your Android device. Uh, you can access it from any laptop, a Mac. Uh, this is awesome. This is set up in RAID 1, and this is the My Cloud Mirror 4 terabyte. So RAID 1 is just a technical way to say that you have two, two terabyte hard drives in here, and it's a redundant system. So what that means is everything you save and backup is going to back up to the first two terabyte hard drive. And then the My Cloud is going to back it up a second time on the second two terabyte hard drive. So you really only have two terabytes to work with and then it mirrors itself into the second drive so you have a redundant backup. So in case one fails, you've got the second one as a backup. This has got a little bit of weight to it. That's the bottom. This is the front. And that's what it looks like. On the back, you've got a data port or a, a network cable port, RJ45 and two USBs. You can plug in two more hard drives to this if you'd like via the USB port, expand your storage even further. Very simple, very simple to do. This comes with a power adapter and it comes with one network cable. I'd say a Cat5, throw that off to the side, and we've got a little handy dandy manual, uh, looks like it's going to be, yeah, it's a manual, or it's a warranty card, or it's something, and I really don't care because I never use this stuff myself, I just hooked this stuff up. So be sure to come back and watch one of my videos to see how I hook this stuff up to make it a lot simpler for you. Right now we're just going to do an unboxing and kind of open this up, get the plastic off of it. There we go. I'd say this weighs a couple of pounds. It's not a bad look. So now remember, this is a network backup, a network cloud. You're going to plug this into your router with the network cable. Any right into the back here, just like that, and then you're going to plug in your power adapter. You're going to plug that into the wall, and this is going to power up the unit. Now this little card I got here is very straightforward, it is very simple. It is a three-step process. It says one, plug it into your router, plug it into the wall, two, turn it on, and then three, go to mycloud.com slash setup, and then sign up for your account. Now, this device, I'll tell you, is very simple and easy to use. We're 
getting another one for the new YouTube studio, and so we decided to do an open box and show you guys what it's about. Um, anybody can access this, not just you. You can give user accounts uh, to anybody you'd like. You have to set up user accounts for people so they can log into this device and get your files. Let's say you guys want to share a movie or you want to share a song or you want to collab on a, a music video or, or whatever. You all store the files on here. You can pull them from any other device. Uh, we use this so we can have one guy doing editing on one video. We can have another person doing editing in Photoshop. We can have another person uh, uploading to YouTube and you know it's just a simple storage mechanism for us to where we can access this simply easily without having to network you know five or six computers together here in the studio so i believe if you just pop this little button here we should be able to just get right inside here and we should be able to see what's going on inside and so right here on the top there's this little little button and you just click it top pops up and there is your hard drives now, it looks like we've got a couple little tabs we could pull on to pull them out once we release this little, got a little clip right here. Got to unscrew that. It's got a little holder to hold the hard drives in place. Your hard drives are labeled number one and number two, you might see here. And then you're just going to want to pull those hard drives out. So easily to replace, just like that. And there's the hard drive, very easy to work on, uh, a beautiful little system. And you just put it right back in the system and you're golden. Same with the second hard drive, just pull, comes right out of there. Now the nice thing about these, if these things fail, you can just easily go get yourself another Western Digital 2 terabyte hard drive or any type of hard drive for that matter and drop inside there and you're back in business. Very quick, very simple, very easy. Shows you very specifically the different hard drives in there. Then you can see that they're numbered. This one's number one. This one over here is number two. Another thing I like about these, if you were working in a environment or an office environment or public environment, you have this little lock for a cable lock right here. Now, we don't use them, but having the, you know, the advantage to use it is incredible. That's, that's a, neat, a neat deal. Just being able to know if you're in a public acts or a public area that people could grab this and take off with all your information, you can kind of lock it down. So anyways, be sure to subscribe to my channel, comment down below, like this video. You know that helps us out if you like it. And ask me if there's anything you'd like to see me do with this hard drive. Do you want to see me, you know, run a, a ton of video files on it and, and how it works? Do you, would you like to see me run some music files off of it? How about I put some music off onto it that's not on my phone or one of my tablets and I show you how to stream live from here onto your phone and Bluetooth the sound into a Bluetooth speaker. Uh, I can do things like that. I don't know. Give me your suggestions, whatever you think. Um, I do want to say, uh, once we hit 100 subscribers, we're going to have a really cool giveaway. So be sure to subscribe. And uh, as soon as we hit that 100 subscriber, we're going to do a drawing and we're going to be giving away some really cool tech. Um, until that time, once again, I'm Wes, that tech guy, and we'll see you around.